This is the just released Nothing launcher and I spent some time with it. In this video, I'll tell you everything you need to know about it. But before that, you need to know what Nothing is. So you heard of OnePlus, right? They actually used to be one of my most favorite smartphone makers until they merged with Oppo. Anyway, this is Carl Pei, one of the co-founders of OnePlus who left the company. And last year, he launched his own company called Nothing. Their first product was the Nothing Ear One, a true wireless earphones that was well received by the consumers. And last month, they had an announcement event where they announced two upcoming products. One was their Nothing Phone One and the other was the new Nothing Launcher. The Nothing Phone One will have an Android 12 based Nothing themed skin and with Nothing Launcher, they're making it available for all. So how can you get it? Well, if your Android phone is running on Android 11 or higher, you will be able to install it from the Google Play Store. Now since I've already installed it on my Micromax in 1P, let's talk about it. So the launcher is quite simple as of now, almost like its name. The UI looks the same as that of Android 12. I get it, there are not a single Android 12 launcher on the Play Store. The only other Android 12 launcher is the Launcher 12 which is currently in development. Anyway, until I installed the Nothing Launcher, I was using the Launcher 12 Alpha 5. And I was surprised to find not much changes in the home screen and app drawer. By default, the app grid is set to 4x5 and the icons are quite large as you can see. Many did not like it, but personally, if you ask me, I loved it. You know what else I would love? Yes, you hitting that like button and giving slap to the red annoying button. Now, if you ask me what's so special about the launcher, well, it's basically just nothing's ringtone, wallpapers and widgets. Not many, just three options each as of now. The ringtones are not my personal favorite. It sounds like someone just started recording an old dot matrix printer. I mean, it fits well into their theme, but don't you think a ringtone must be loud and audible? Coming to the wallpapers, the three of them shares a similar theme and I like it personally. It's definitely something MKBHD would like with the red, black and white theming. The widgets are something that really attracted me. They are really functional and looks good. You get three widgets, an analog clock, a digital clock and a weather widget. Touching the clock widgets obviously opens the clock app and touching the weather widget opens the AccuWeather website. Another thing I like is the ability to enlarge icons, especially the folders. Now since this is still in the beta stage, there are a ton of things to improve and one main thing I feel should be updated as soon as possible is the settings. See for yourself, long press on the home screen and hit the home settings, the only options are set as default launcher, notification dots, an option to add icons to home and the about. That's it. Now if you ask me how you will change the icons or the app grid, well that's not in the home settings but in the wallpaper and styles. Also I said I liked the big icons but after a few hours of use I found them a little too big and when I looked for an option to adjust it, I didn't find an option. So they need to make proper settings for each bit and piece of the UI element unless they don't want much customization to be enabled in their launcher. And as you can see, I also found a bug with the weather widget while filming this video. Anyway, those are some things that nothing needs to work on. I know there are a lot of people who does not like this launcher. I mean, they need to understand that this is still in its beta version. So it will be getting more updates in the future and I'm actually looking forward to it. So me being a half glass full guy, I'm actually expecting this launcher to get more updates and this is going to be in my phone for the next few weeks. Anyway, that's pretty much it for this short video. More videos are coming so stay tuned. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. My name is Neved and until next video, I'll see you later.